the core problem with financial crises is that the only way to stop them and fix them is to do things that people view as unjust and immoral by doing a bunch of things that are tragically offensive to people. You know, when you got a big, ugly problem, the idea that you're going to have some elegant solution just is a, a pipe dream. So you're trading off doing something that's really unattractive versus doing nothing at all, which may be worse. Do you think another crisis like 2008 could happen again? There's a set of rules. Then the industry innovates. And they come up with things that aren't covered by the rules. So you have to have new rules. And you have new rules and they work for a while, but then people find a way around it. So the next crisis will come when there's another innovation that gets around these rules. These crises are going to happen again and again. I think that's one thing that you learn when you go through that. The same crisis is almost certainly not going to happen. Something else will, but not the same. I don't know any banker who can look at themselves today and say, you know, we didn't make mistakes. Yet, most bankers at the time were as focused on helping provide a solution as they were just looking at their, at their own problems. People were trying to help each other. We were all trying to do the right thing for the country, and, and of course we were all part of the problem, but that doesn't mean you weren't trying to do the right thing for the country.